way funky with y'all, I got about four to maybe five good pieces that I build my wardrobe on. I don't got a lot of pieces. Love me, boy, you just know. Move us, boy, let me love me. Go up in my, go up in my day. Hi, guys. Welcome back to the channel. So today, as the title kind of stated a little bit, it's just going to be about, um, this video rather, it's just going to be about building your wardrobe and building it up from like the basics. So I get a lot of questions. Um, lately, I have gotten a lot of questions as far as like, um, by the way, I broke my pinky nail. Right when I was putting on my clothes, y'all, I broke my pinky nail. That's up, right? Anyway. So I get a lot of questions as far as, um, of course, where do I get my pieces from? If you don't have a lot of money, like how do you build your wardrobe up like piece by piece? Um, and like what do you like build your wardrobe on? Um, I also get a lot of questions about like my lashes. So let me get a little closer for you guys. I actually, my homegirl in um, West, Palm, West Palm Beach, Florida, she sells lashes. And I will link her information in the description box below because um, she sells like mink lashes. So this is where I get all my mink lashes from. Whenever you guys see me with lashes on, I have gotten them from her. That's where I get all my lashes from. Don't even deal with the beauty supply store no more. I just go, I call her up and be like, hey girl, what kind of lashes you got on sale, girl? Let me get some lashes, girl. So yeah, that's where I get all my lashes from. Um, but... So the video I'm going to be going over, and I'm going to keep this in there. Ain't this a mishap? Hmm. Bet you I keep going. <laughs> but so, okay, so the video is going to be going over the basics as far as what you should have in your wardrobe um, just to like build upon. Like your basic essentials that you should have, what I feel like you should have, or that I rather have in my wardrobe that I build upon. Because to be all the way funky with y'all, I got about four to maybe five good pieces that I build my wardrobe on. I don't got a lot of pieces like that. Y'all may see me with like dresses on with like pops of color. But for the most part, I got about four or five good pieces. And I just build my wardrobe on those four to five good pieces. So, I'm going to teach y'all how to do the same thing. Without further ado, yes, you probably just seen the cat run by, y'all. Y'all know I got fur babies. I know my baby. So without further ado, guys, let's get into this clothes. Cool. Guys, so the first item, which is like one of my go-to items, whether it's spring, summer, winter, or fall, is of course the LBD. Little black dress. I actually got this little black dress from Boohoo. Oh, I think it might have been between seven or ten dollars. I can't really remember. I've had it for a while. Um, so I love my little black dress. It is a spaghetti strap dress, um, and I can actually pair this with boots. I mean, I can pair it with a cute blazer in the winter, you know, or um, not really the winter, but like the fall, or really like in the spring or summer. Of course, like a look like this, or like a cute duster have my hair down with it. Um, this is really a cute look for me. I really actually love like this look because I can build upon this look. And of course, as always, you guys probably can't see, but some just simple black slides or sandals. I actually happened to get these from Rainbow. I get a little closer so y'all can see the slides. Hold on y'all, I'm coming. So these are the slides. Just some simple black slides from Rainbow um, that I did actually purchase. These were actually like five bucks. Um, but I love like simple little nothings. So I purchased a lot of those. And ladies, when you guys see stuff like on sale, even if you don't have an outfit to put it with, if it's on sale and it you have it to buy, like and it fits your budget, get it. I mean, freak it. Like, why not? Like, get it. Because you can always match it with something else in your wardrobe. And that's how you start building your wardrobe, piece by piece. These bangles, it's like 34 more of them upstairs. Yeah, I said 34. These came from Rainbow. 
Hey guys, so the next outfit that I have um, that I just built from the basics, just basically like a cami, some leggings, blazer, purse, and my pumps. That's it. This blazer is a blazer that I got from Rome We, if I'm not mistaken, and I'll link it. If it doesn't pop up here or over here, it'll pop up so that you guys can go and click on it to actually see where I got the blazer from. Um, I actually got these pumps from Charlotte Russe. So I'll get a little bit closer in a minute. And I got this actual cobalt blue black, cobalt blue bag. Come, Twister. I got it from Amazon. So, this is it. A basic outfit, just building, so I got some in my eye, y'all, just building the outfit from really nothing, so that it can have, like, of course, a pattern with it, and, you know, pops of color, things like that, so, and I'll just show y'all what it looks like, basically, <laughs> purse, then I take, of course, the blazer off so it's really just really a basic outfit take my heels off and just a regular basic actually a lot of people wear this around the house just a regular cami I like to get my camis, honestly, guys, from Rainbow because they have the built-in bra support all the way around, the adjustable straps. And I actually got these leggings. I got them from Walmart. I'm learning to love their Walmart leggings because they're more quality now, um, so they're not sheeny shiny. I hate sheeny shiny leggings because when you walk, it's like corduroy. Right? It's like zoop, 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 zoop. zoop. And then they're see-through, and they're just not good quality. They get runs in them, like stockings. It gets weird. I love these because they're more of like a cotton, like polyester blend, and they feel so soft, um, but they're not see-through. So, you don't see nothing. Um, I actually believe these are Terra, I want to say Terra Nova. It's Terra something. I forgot the actual name of the brand. Um, and just to give you an up close of the shoe, because I always get criticized by you guys when I say I get close. So this is the actual shoe, hi my pinky, that I got from Charlotte Russe. Um, I actually got this shoe a while ago. Like, this shoe is like really over like two or three years old. So this is an old shoe. <laughs> Had it for a while. I'm going to bring it out on special occasions because it hurt my feet. If you get what I'm saying. But yeah, so that was just basically really that outfit. It just really is a basic outfit. Get you a whole bunch of good black leggings that go all the way down to the ankles, guys. Get your leggings that go down to the ankles. A good cami that's supportable, that's not see-through, that's not cheap, that's actually long. Because my camis are quite long. If they cover halfway mid of my butt, it's a long cami. So invest, invest into your like basic wardrobe and then build on that wardrobe from there with the shoe in my hand. Hey guys, so the next piece is more so like an accessory. Um, it's an accessory for me and what I need for my wardrobe. And that's a black duster. Like, I love black dusters. Anything, let me skip, step back so you guys can get the full kind of scope. Anything that's like long, like this, duster-wise, I should absolutely love. And I love to pair them with tube dresses because it gives it like a different look and a different feel. I just paired it with some open toe black kind of um, heels that I have. But I love a good black um, duster. I just love dusters, period. I'm not going to lie. Like, no matter what the color what the material is, if it's sleeveless or long sleeve, I love dusters just period. And I think every woman should at least have like one or two in their wardrobe, especially a black one. A black one is a must, especially one like this because not only can this double as like a cover up for this tube dress, this can also double, up, double as a like a, um, 
a cover up for like a bathing suit. And it's lightweight. I actually got this duster from Boohoo. I've had it for a while. But they're good with very, I don't like short. Like here, here, here. I don't like really like short dusters. I love the long because it gives a different look to it and a different feel. Especially like the movement. When you get to walking, like me and my best friend have a joke that's like they're capes. So she actually started calling them capes and then I started calling them capes. But when you walk and like it just it flows. So it looks like a cape. So it's really cute though. But a duster just gives a different look and a different feel to an outfit. Like it's a it's like a tie-dye moment. If that makes sense to you guys. It's like if you walk in, let's say I have on a strapless bra, because I do have a bra to have on straps. But let's say I walk in and like this is my outfit, right? This is what I'm coming in with. And then I get in and I take my duster off. Now look at me. Still the same look. Not the same look, but it's like, ooh, who was that? Like, I don't see her when she came in. <laughs> so a duster gives it like a different look and a different vibe. That's why I absolutely, absolutely, I'm so tongue-tied tonight. But that's why I absolutely love dusters. Okay, guys. So I'm not normally like a jean or a jagging kind of girl. But I'm slowly getting there. So I'm realizing how essential like leggings and jeggings are to the wardrobe. So I actually got these kind of light colored um, wash um, jeggings rather from Boohoo. These are a size, I can't remember the size, I'll link it below. Um, and white shirts. White shirts, ladies, are a must. It takes your outfit to the next level. It is such a sharper look. I actually got this top from um, Rev Dolls. It's just a regular white short sleeve top and it ties up. And then I love a good duster as we all know. So putting a duster on the inside out y'all. I actually just paired it with this duster that I got from Amazon. I actually use this kind of doubled as like a full cover up. And I paired it with some cobalt blue heels, um, like pumps that I got from Charlotte Russe. So they give you a full 360 on a duster because the duster's life. Um, but this is something that I would wear just like, I would possibly wear this like going out, but really more so like daytime. So that's what this outfit would be for me. And I would just like throw this on if it was kind of nippy or chilly out. But I would actually wear it like so. So when you take the duster off, as I always say, the duster gives you a completely different look. It makes it, it it's able to be like a reveal, like, ta-da. <laughs> That's actually what the duster is able to do. That's why I love dusters. Um, but yes, Stone wash, light colored jeans, white shirts, they are a must, ladies. These are things that you should put into your wardrobe. I mean, this takes the look to a whole new level. I haven't adjusted the back, so I'm not going to give y'all full 360. And just a cute pump or sandal, boot, whatever, to dress it up. So, this is actually how you build your pieces. So, it's just a basic piece. Just added some pumps to it, did a duster. Take the duster off at the big reveal. It's still a simple classic look, but it's a sharper classic look. 